as the famous sign says in the players' tunnel, this is Anfield. I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith, as usual, alongside me to provide the analysis. Premier League football for you, very shortly. It's Liverpool against Tottenham Hotspur. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to it. I think we're going to have an entertaining tussle here. I think we'll find that out in the first ten minutes, how these teams approach the task. Robertson, number five. Jorginho Vinaldo. Liverpool getting Number it right 14, at the back and building from that, Henderson. building on the best defence. Well, defending is an art Firmino. and sometimes a forgotten one in this Number day and 11, age, but this lot Mohamed haven't forgotten it, that's for sure. Salah. And number 10, Sadio Mane. And great. Three changes for Liverpool. In goal is Allison, and Robertson starts with Nathaniel Klein as the wide defenders. Abi Keita plays with Jorginho Wijnaldum in the centre of the park, and Roberto Firmino is the one striker. Spurs have made one change. Hugo Lloris starts in goal. Toby Aldevarel starts alongside Davinson Sanchez at the back. Tongi Undombele plays with Musa Sissoko in midfield. In attack, Harry Kane starts. He scored a hat trick in the last game. Can find some space here on the flanks. Firmino! That touch off the defender has stranded the goalkeeper. No chance for him. It's always so difficult for a keeper in a crowded penalty area when it gets a deflection, and that did for him here, I think. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Wijnaldum. This could be an opportunity in behind the defence. Brilliant goal! Well, it's the understanding you've got to admire here, Martin. The lad getting on to the end of it, the boy seeing the pass quickly. Different angle on it here. Now Keita. Good vision. Can he finish it now? Firmino! Brilliant goal! Oh, no wonder he goes over to thank the lad who set him up there because that was a wonderful move. I think they've practiced that one on the training ground. And here's the goal again. They're playing Watford in their next match in the round of 16. Can't really see too much between the sides. I think it'll be close. So much it. The keeper's given the ball away. Well, look, they've got one back. <laughs> Don't know what the keeper thought he was doing but it didn't work out for him, and now he's got to pick the ball out of his net. Well, if in doubt, just launch it upfield, but he's tried to be a little bit more precise and 
Well, he won't look back on that with any fondness. Problems now. They conceded the penalty. Well, that's the last thing they needed. They weren't playing well, but to give the opposition that criminal. The penalty. I think it was clear cut, and the fact that the referee's not so booked anyone is that a bit lenient? Maybe, but on the plus side, I think he's showing a bit of common sense. The penalty, the I feel, is punishment Lamella. enough. Eric He's done the job, he's the specialist. And that has got the goal from the penalty spot, well taken. Yeah, he's a man you can depend on in these situations because he does keep a clear and cool head. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. It's finished here. Well, we've seen a game here, Alan, where one team has had the ball and the other team hasn't. <laughs> yeah, there was, a, there was a golfing class out there today, which was surprising given the two sets of players. I wasn't expecting it. Well, they have had such a great defence, the home side, and they've added to that quality with some real attacking skill today. Yeah, they've just brought it all together, and in this kind of form, they're going to be really hard to beat.